Hi, this is Linda with the Life Station Express, the relay station. We bring the news to you. Today I'm just going to make a real quick short video about some of the things that I eat on keto. And I want to make this really <laughs> encouraging for others because there are things you get to eat on keto that people may not have realized that you get to eat. So anyway, sometimes it's not about the things that you cut out, it's about the things that you get to do. So we're not gonna talk about cutting out the sugar, the rice, the pasta, the seed oils right now. I'm gonna show you some of the things that we do get to eat when we're following the ketogenic lifestyle. I'll have them over here on the table and I've done similar videos, but this is just gonna be a quick, real quick one. So come along with me. Number one, the first thing you get to eat is bacon. And I find this bacon at my local discount store. Several of the things that I buy regularly, I do go to the local discount store because this bacon was $2.99 for 12 ounces. Can't beat that. And it is no antibiotics, no growth hormones. It's natural, um, humanely raised, gluten-free, anyway. It's a butter bacon. So, yes, if you if you eat bacon, I know some people don't do pork, so that's okay, but if you do pork, bacon is on the list. Also, cheeses are on the list. So, different kinds of cheeses. You have to watch the label to see, you know, what the carb count is on your cheese because if you're keto, you want to keep your carb carb count 20 per day or less. If you're doing low carb, that is between 50 and 100. And um, no one should be over 100, I, in my personal opinion. Anyway, if you want to heal your body or lose weight, and I don't do this to lose weight, I do this to heal my body, and it's, it's working. So one of the things we have a lot is cream cheese. And again, the discount store. <laughs> this cream cheese was $1.79 for the block of cream cheese. And Richard has been making two egg omelets every morning. He adds cream cheese to his omelet and he will also add some cheddar so again the discount store <laughs> $2.29 which i think is fair it's not the best price but it, this is a, a cheese that we found out that we do like it's called new york Sh new york sharp cheddar cheese so that's one thing that you can have on keto one of the main things that is just a staple if you're doing a ketogenic way of eating and you can use it for everything, so many things. And you know how many videos I've done about making chaffles. Well, this is what you need to make your chaffles. You need an egg. So look at this beautiful um, set of eggs. It's a dozen that I got from a local person who has eggs. And if you're local to me, um, I can get you her name and number because these are 350, which is a, is a decent price for eggs. And look at all the different colors she has so I was really pleased I have a couple of egg sources and that's just one of them more and more people are raising chickens so another staple good old beef again the discount store I just I, why why not why not go to the discount store $3.99 I can't get it much cheaper than that anywhere except for maybe Sam's even the beef that um, would come in a quarter or half a beef is a little more than this so here's a pound of beef and we have beef oh i'm gonna say at least three times a week you know in whatever we're i i prepare it different ways just to keep this short heavy whipping cream goes in a lot of things um there is carbohydrates and heavy whipping cream it may say um zero but they can put that on the label because there's less than one so they can put zero. So it should have a little less than sign, but it's less than one. Heavy whipping cream. I use it for whipped cream for my chaffles. I put it a little bit in my coffee, probably a tablespoon. That's probably it. But that is definitely always in my fridge. Let's see. You always want to have water. You want to drink enough water. You don't have to overdo it with water. That was a sales gimmick as well. Back in the day to sell, guess what? Bottled water. But you do want some water. You do want to be hydrated. And one way to stay hydrated is to get your electrolytes in. This is the Pure Boost, and I get three or four different flavors of the Pure, Pure Boost. This one is the orange. And we also use Zip Fizz. There's a blueberry, and there's an orange. 
and I've talked about these before, but you can order these online. This is called Zip Fizz. The other one is Pure Boost. And um, just to, to wrap this up, just to give you a basic couple things. If you're going to cook and you want different meat, meat meals, you might want some sauces or some condiments. So we buy the ones that have no added sugar or they use sucralose or stevia or some other sweetener. If you're okay with that, which we're fine with these, you don't use that much. You know, you put a little barbecue sauce or I have the ketchup from this one too. And, um, you know, that's where we go. No sugar added. Also have the, um, I use the Rayo's um, marinara sauce. I made a pizza the other day. You can go on my, face, my, um, yeah, my Facebook page or my YouTube channel and look at that pizza. The crust was made with a cloud bread recipe, which I've made cloud bread. That's one of the, thing, the things I made in the very beginning was learn how to make cloud bread. Then I moved from that to chaffles and I've made multiple chaffle recipes. But anyway, that's just a few of the things that we have as staples while we are eating keto, which we will be eating keto for the rest of our lives. Like I said before, my carotid arteries are clearing and Richard's A1C is going down. Every time he's gone to the doctor, it's been lower. So we are very fortunate that I feel I found out about the ketogenic lifestyle. It wasn't hard for me to switch over because it means I'm healing my body. That's very important. I want to be here for a while. So this is Linda with the Life Station Express. And those are just a few things that we have pretty much all the time, always in the fridge. And there are other things too, but those are just some of our staples. All right, I'll talk to you soon. Thanks so much. Bye.